Hi friends, today let's learn how do we convert a different data type, let's say float or an object or a string to an integer. I have the CSV file or I can say this is a text file with a delimiter as semicolon. So this file or this uh, particular file has three columns which is round, decimals and comma. I just created for just for the sake of an example where we have the first column rounded off and the second column has a decimal and the third column has a comma to it. So we have to get rid of these decimals and we have to get rid of this comma. So let's see how do we do this. First thing is we need to import pandas. I'll say import pandas as pd. Okay. Then I'll create a data frame. Data frame is equal to pd dot read underscore csv. Make a note. So even though that's not a csv file, that's a text file with the delimiter of semicolon we are using read underscore csv and then we need to specify the path the file is in c drive c temp convert so dot txt as i mentioned we have to specify the separator separator is semicolon hit enter i'll go to the new line and i'll see how does the data frame look yeah, so this is what we were seeing in the text file. So under decimals, we have dot zero and then we have a comma next in the commas column. So we want to see what is the data type of each column so that it makes us understand what we need to do. So after I'll type, I'll type df dot, oh, sorry, d type, enter, oh, sorry, it's d types. It says round, the column round is integer column decimals is float and column comma is an object object here means string so let's start one by one let's convert decimals from float to integer so what I'm going to do is I'll pick that column data frame decimals copy this equal to so the reason being we are performing this action on the column decimals dot as type means what do you want to convert to it's float so we have to convert that into integer I'll type int which is integers then let's run the data frame to see how it looks yeah as you can see initially we had 2020.0 we have 2020 so we solved the first riddle the second one is a bit tricky that we need to quit that means we have to eliminate this comma Let's do that. So we have to pick that column that is comma. Oops, this is an additional bracket. Comma is equal to comma. Let's try the same method what we did earlier by converting that to an integer. Let's see what we get got an error and the error says invalid literal for integer with base 10 so the normal approach what we followed does not work here so there should be another better approach right so let's see what is that better approach I'll go back here I'll remove this so we know this column comma is object so when it's object it's string so why don't we do a string conversion or do a string manipulation I'll say string replace so I want to replace with what I want to replace comma with nothing so basically I'm learning just replace comma with nothing so then it converts into 2020 and then again it converts to 2020 but not as integer it will convert that as float so what I'm going to do is I'll type as type integer let's see how it works so it throw me no error so it means it's working oops let's go to the new line and let's see the data frame keep the finger crossed and there you see we have 20 20 20 let's see the data types integer 64 32 32 that doesn't doesn't matter but we achieved what we wanted to achieve right i hope you like this video thank you and subscribe to my channel